Let's test 10 cool things you can do with ChatGPT today, and I'm doing all of these from my phone. Number 10 is write a script for your next YouTube or TikTok video or whatever platform you want. For this example, I asked for three skincare tips. If you think it's too long, you can ask for it to be shorter. If you think it's too short, you can ask for it to be longer. Say you don't like these tips. You can ask it to switch the tips. Number nine, you can write a blog post in a matter of seconds. Let's ask it to write a 500 word blog article on preparing for a new puppy and see how it does. You can pause it to read, but I think that's fantastic. In a matter of seconds, for free, you have a 500 word blog post in whatever niche you like. Number eight, write an essay. For this example, I'm asking AI to write an essay about AI. You can specify the thesis and how long you'd like the essay to be. You can include as many details as you'd like. You can ask it to argue for or against a side. Pause if you want to read this essay, but I think it did a really good job. Probably much better than anything I would have written. Number seven, write a quick caption for your Instagram photo. Remember, the more details you include, the more it has to work with. I wasn't super happy with this caption, so I asked for three more captions. That's not bad. What do you think? Number six, write a speech for your best friend's wedding. Just put in some details about your friend and let Chad GPT make it sound really good. Again, pause to read the whole speech and let me know what you think in the comments below. Number five, write a story. More specifically, let's write a children's story that rhymes and is about sharing. And that's it. In a matter of seconds, you just wrote a book. You can also use AI to generate photos for your book and you can self-publish using Amazon KDP. What do you think about that idea? Number four, write a resume. Let's pretend you're a graphic designer with five years of experience doing freelance and you have a two-year college degree. You can put as much information as you want, but just based on that little bit, you just got a pretty good resume template. Number three, you can write a recipe. In this example, I'm just going to ask for a basic chocolate chip cookie recipe and ta-da, I have a recipe. Now, I'm curious to know if this recipe actually turns out good. I might try that for a different video. Number two, write a contract. For example, I can ask it to create a TikTok licensing agreement. You can even specify where you're located so it takes into consideration the laws pertaining to where you live. Do you think this will make a lawyer's job easier or do you think this is threatening their jobs as a whole? And number one, you can ask it to write code. In this example, I'm asking it to write code for an app that's similar to Tinder where you can swipe, match, and message people. Now, I'm not a coder, so I can't really tell you if it did a good job or not. But if any coders out there are watching this, comment below if it did a decent job. Plus, I'm sure a coder could put in better prompts to get better results. 